you know, leeward hat, what I would say just from a safety and quality standpoint is make sure we're taking care of our technicians. A lot of times when we, we get to the corporate office, we forget about what the guys are dealing with day in and day out, whether onshore or offshore, up tower, down tower, and uh, remember where our techs are at and what they're doing and uh, just take care of our techs and ultimately they'll take care of our wind farms. You know, I, you know, looking at so many peers and friends that I made in the last several years and now being on the owner side is uh, really any silos you have in your, your company, both sides have them. And it's not just, I'm not talking about a Gonquin Power, I'm talking industry wide. Getting in early in your procurement phases of operations to understand what it takes to run a wind farm 20 years from now. Uh, the general cost of, from met towers to roads to uh, everything in between to the turbine. Partnering with your OEM, I think it's gonna be a great survival for companies to continue to have a great relationship of what is the lifespan of a gearbox, a generator. And then us as owners putting the premise back to the OEM saying, no more serial defects. Everyone's afraid to talk about it, but why are we still getting serial defects to this day? If it was in the air industry, uh, those companies would be shut down because planes would be crashing every day. You know, why are we still getting bad blades? Why are we still getting bad gearboxes or bearings? It's enough, and the industry has to mature a lot faster because there's still that uh, not trusting relationship between OEMs and owners because of serial defects, and that's got to be the quality. I think OEMs they take another leap not accepting the, the bad quality that's been out there for many, many years. Yeah, it's, we had a good time, uh, connected with a lot of our uh, vendors, uh, people we had relationships with uh, before we came, um, met a few new people, uh, some relationships that we'll, we'll keep going with in the future, and uh, uh, we'll be back next year.